Will your home pass the test? Can you sell your home for top dollar right now? Or do you need to do a few things to make sure you get top dollar? Hi, I'm Beverly Offrey. I'm the broker owner of the premium class and team lead of the Offrey Group, brokered by EXP Realty. So let's take a quiz to see if your home passes the sell for top dollar test. We've sold hundreds of homes, so we know what we're talking about. Here we go. When you walk up to the home, does it have curb appeal, fresh landscaping, maybe a bit of black bark, fresh flowers, plant or trees, new trim and door paint, or possibly even a new paint job? You need to hire someone who cares more about getting you top dollar than possibly hurting your feelings. Have you done the three Ds, decluttered, depersonalized, and deep cleaned? I mean, real deep cleaning baseboards scuff marks cleaned up the landscape change out light bulbs and more is your lawn lavish and green or yellow and crispy yes these things matter are the walls painted in neutral color have you patched holes painted the front door and trim hey Break red walls with mismatched paint does not quantify selling for top dollar. At least not in this market. Do you have neutral carpets that are clean? Or are they 10 years old that have been cleaned 15 times and once it rains? Or people walk over them a few times? Well, the truth comes out. This isn't going to cut it to get top dollar. Do you have updated flooring and countertops? Or are your cabinets still the same as they were 15 years ago? Or have you updated them? Does your lot compare to the one half acre lot that is up the street? You see, all this matters. This is a big one, the smell test. Oh my God, I'm sure you don't realize it, but did you know that most people have a smell to their home? Yes, a smell. I know it sounds gross, but it's true. We love pets. In fact, I have two, Jean-Pierre and Booba, and they go with me everywhere. But if I were to list my home, I'd have to Febreze like crazy. You see, my two puppies had peed on my throw rugs like nobody's business. I have to constantly wash and clean. So when I sell my home, I have to make changes and I'd even have to pass my own smell test. What about cooking? Do you cook with spices that you are used to, but if someone else come over, it would smell like fish fry? Again, that's a no-go. Have you truly compared your home to your competition? I mean, everyone, including me, thinks that I have the best home on the block. I mean, listen. I know granny, I spent five weeks putting in the old white tiles with brown graft. But is this measuring up to your competition? Is your home partially staged or fully staged with modern furnitures to ensure it shows to the best of its ability? Or is your furniture outdated and probably would look better in grandma's house? Hey, don't treat the messenger. I'm just trying to help. When you look out the window, are you looking at your neighbor showering? Or is there a pasture, hills, or waterfront? Yes, believe it or not, looking at your neighbor's butt crack thingy majigger or hearing them yell over who gets to pick what to watch on TV tonight isn't quite as desirable as having an open view. So I challenge you. Take the quiz and get a scale from 1 to 10 if you're ready to put your house on the market and sell for top dollar or if you need to make a few changes. P.S. Most of us have to make changes. Oh my God, if I were to sell my house, I'd have a honey to-do list for days. This is Beverly Offre with the Offre Group. We're here to provide you with an exceptional real estate experience and make your home selling and buying journey both successful and enjoyable. Give us a call.